Hey, let me show you what you can do if you cannot connect a Samsung Galaxy Buds 3 FE into your Android phone. So first of all, I will start by opening system settings, go to the Bluetooth. And first of all, just make sure that you turn off Bluetooth like so. There we go. Now, I will also recommend you to check if you charge this device. So if you are pressing the pairing button and it is not working, it means that you will have to recharge the case and earbuds inside with closed case for around five or 10 minutes. After that, when this indicator lights up, it means that you have enough battery to boot them into the pairing mode. So you will have to just keep both earbuds inside, but open this cover. Now you will have to click and hold this button that is located on the bottom of the charging case and wait until indicator starts blinking. If it is not working, like in my case, as you can see, you will have to release and simply repeat. So just be patient. There we go. Now as you can see, it is working properly. So I have to release that button, keep that case open and put it close to my device. And I have to turn on Bluetooth. Now I have to wait for available devices list and select Buds 3 FE. If it is not working for you, you still cannot find your earbuds on the available devices list then I can highly recommend you to go back from this one and search on your phone for some reset options. So you have to search for some system settings or system management, depends of your phone model, go to the reset options and I can highly recommend you to try to reset Bluetooth settings. Just click over here and get all the default settings. Now let's go back to the Bluetooth settings and let's check if we are connected. Yeah, as you can see now everything is fine. I'm successfully connected. And now you have to just go for the Galaxy wearable application to set it up. There we go. And if you are still unable to connect or something like that, you can additionally try to restart your phone. So simply just turn it off and then turn it on. Now let's see if we can actually connect here in the application. Yeah, it looks like that we can connect. We have to just accept end user license agreement. And we are all set. And now Okay, now we are not set. Okay, now everything is fine and is working properly. So that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.